Hi, I'm State Senator Gail Harrell. It's been my honor to serve you in the Florida Senate for these past two years and previously in the Florida House. I'm running for re-election because in these extremely challenging times, we need a proven leader who knows our community and is fighting for us. Experience matters now more than ever. As a 49-year resident of the Treasure Coast, a former teacher in our public schools, a business owner and active community volunteer, I know our amazing community. I've lived through the many challenges we have faced over the years, from hurricanes to the collapse of the housing market to the devastating releases from Lake Okeechobee. Now we face the most challenging times brought on by COVID-19. The pressing issue is the economic crisis we face. We have to focus on job creating policies and getting Floridians back to work. I'll fight to keep taxes low, cut red tape, work with our local colleges to help retrain displaced workers and connect them with new opportunities. I am so pleased that my daughter and her wonderful family have moved back to the Treasure Coast. It's wonderful having my grandkids close to home. But I'm concerned about the impacts COVID-19 is having on our students' education. Even though Florida's education system is ranked third in the nation and we have among the highest starting salaries for teachers in the country, this pandemic has magnified the importance of parental choice when it comes to their child's education. Whether the decision is between in-person instruction or online learning, traditional, private, or charter schools, I will keep fighting to put parents in the driver's seat when it comes to their child's education. COVID-19 also presents serious healthcare challenges. Many of you may have known my wonderful husband, Dr. James Harrell, who was an OBGYN in this community while I ran the business side of the medical practice. As chair of the Health Policy Committee in the Florida Senate, I've led the way to make meaningful reforms and paved the way for the use of telehealth in Florida. I'll keep fighting to make quality health care more accessible and more affordable. You can't talk about policy issues on the Treasure Coast without talking about water and our environment. I passed Legacy Florida, which has put over $1.2 billion into stopping the releases from Lake Okeechobee pushed for record funding of $2.3 billion going to DEP, and spearheaded the Clean Waters Act, which reforms policies regarding septic tanks, biosolids, and wastewater. Experience matters. Commitment to our community counts. I would respectfully ask for your vote on November 3rd. For more information, go to my website, gailharrell.com.